Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of Watch Talk Live. Uh, we're going to have a, uh, a interesting guest tonight. I'm showing. Okay, one second, folks. We're okay. Sorry, had had a little small glitch there. So, uh, but uh, you know, welcome everyone to uh, Watch Talk Live. We've got a uh, a fun and, and uh, interesting guest tonight. Um, Want to thank him for uh, coming on and you know talking with us and showing him some watches. Also, want to uh, salute. Uh, I know his daughter's in the Air Force, so you know appreciate that. And uh, he's got quite a a wide selection and all of that. And I'm sure you all know him. And, uh, so we'll, uh, bring him up to the stream and welcome Pappy to the show. Hey buddy. Hi, how you doing, John? Good evening, everybody. Good, good. Good. What's going on tonight? Not much. Just kind of, you know, getting warmed up here. We've got Let's see, who do we got in here? We got Godfather and Nightwing and Vic and uh, let's see who else? Elwin's in the house and uh, Pappy and Rick, Trap. So welcome everyone, welcome to uh, Watch Talk and uh, we'll get uh, going here. So... My normal question <laughs> to start off is uh, virtual sizing time. Hey, Kimon. Good evening. Uh, we'll uh, we'll forego the uh, we'll go we'll forego the uh, the sizing videos tonight. So we'll uh, we'll kind of let that one go. But uh, <laughs> but with that, you know, I'll kind of open up with uh, you know the the regular question of who or what got you interested in watches. Uh, pretty much. I got a Bolivar from the wife and, uh, you know, I got that one. It was real small. And then one day I was watching uh, TV and I saw uh, Evine live and it was showing watches. And I was like, oh, this is interesting. Let me buy one or two. And I'm like, oh, these are pretty cool. So uh, I went and got an elegant diver and I got a, uh, a scuba. Picked that up and a sea spider. Okay. And then I kept watching the shows and I just kept buying more and more and more. And I just got real interested <laughs> in the movements and the way they looked and the size and the way they spoke about the watches and the colors, the executions. I mean, it just, it really, uh, you know, it really made me. Look at a watch a little different. I mean, I had them young, but it was like, ah, oh, they, they break, you throw them out. But I uh, haven't had one in a long time. And then I just kept buying them. I went into the chats, and uh, I got involved, and I listened to you guys and see what you had to say, and uh, listened to Kendi and Ryan and Justin. Yeah. And uh, it just took off from there. I haven't stopped. <laughs> it's about six years now. Okay, so about six years. Okay, so uh, you know you were talking about as as a kid. Did you were you in into watches younger or just kind of like it was a thing or you really didn't? I I was into them younger, but not not as much. Okay, not as much. Yeah, I mean, you know, you get the Timex watch or you get the uh, Dick Tracy watch and. Mm -hmm. But I did have an interest in pocket watches because my father had one. I used to take it and I put it in my pocket and go out and wind it up and all that stuff. So mm -hmm. I did have a little interest. Okay. Um, younger, you know. Yeah. So then you're, so if you went, so your first Invicta was the Pro Diver or? It was the Elegant Diver. The Elegant Diver. Okay. Cool, cool. It was uh, just a plain sunray dial, uh, yeah. no date or anything. Yeah. 
Then I got a, a scuba. Yeah. Okay. So and then a sea were, spider. Oh, okay. So if you were going to go with a, uh, let's say you you were you know looking over the stuff, what would be like your go to like series like Subaquanoma, Venom, Specialty? I I would say. I would say the uh, SAS mm -hmm. for sure. I really yeah. love the design of it. Okay. And the way it wears on the wrist. The Venoms are a little tight for me, better on the wrist. The lugs are a little wider, curvy, mm -hmm. curve different. But. Yeah. Yeah. So I see you got some, some swag and some stuff back there. So uh, why don't you kind of take us through a little bit of that and, and – uh, Give us a rundown here. All right. Uh, let's see what we could start out with. Here's the uh, Jason Taylor Sass Spinel. Yeah. We got that last week. My first Jason Taylor. Okay. Right there. That's a night. Yeah. That that's a good one to start with. <laughs> yep. Here's my. Here's my beast, Diamond Beast. They were showing this last night. Yeah, very nice. Yeah. With the carbon fiber. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that, that's a good one. Uh, here's a nice heritage, Swiss made, Bolt Zeus. Okay. Is that the uh, that's a brown mother of pearl or black? That is the, that is the black. There it is. Beautiful. And that's got the SW200. Yeah. Here is the Grand Sub Aqua Noma 3 with the SW500. Oh, nice. Yeah. Yeah, you don't see too many uh, threes with the 500 in it. No. And like you said, the seconds is so small. You don't get to appreciate the uh, the you know when it sweeps. Yeah. The Twenty-eight eight hundred vibrations per hour. Yeah. But this is I love the case back on this. I really love the case back on this. It's just let me see that. You can see it there. Oh yeah. I really love it. It spins around. It's got ball bearings and all that. Yeah, yeah. I I love I love the two hundreds. It's a really accurate movement. In fact, I was looking through some of like the COSC standards and everything. I believe right. it was uh, minus seven seconds uh, deviation. I think the uh, the two hundred. I think the five hundred, but memory doesn't serve me. Is minus four. So it's definitely up there. Yeah, we have a Sand 7 blue label. Oh, yeah. Now, is that the – okay, so that's the non-shutter version? Yeah. The non-shutter version. Yeah. Uh, the abalone dial there. Oh, yeah. That's a good one. Yeah. Beautiful. I, I, I love the uh, the alternating on the blue on the dragons with the blue. Oh, yes. Yeah. Very cool. Yeah. Very cool. And of course, the cruise Bolt Zeus Magnum. Yeah, I mean, I got it online. I didn't go on that cruise, but I, I got it when, <laughs> when it came out. Yeah, as soon as it launched. Yeah, yeah, so, that was that was that was a crazy night that night. Yeah, yeah. Kimon was saying he he uh, he loves that Speedway Beast. He's got the uh, the two tone on the way. There's a chaos meteorite. Okay. Now and is that, that is that the two tone? Uh, yes, it is. Okay. And it's got the R150. Obviously, mm -hmm. you all know that. <laughs> yeah, it's a little better. I love yeah. the bracelet design on it. Yeah, yeah. That I have to say, uh, Imperius. I'm I'm glad they've. I'm glad they brought at least the, the models back because there's been some, I mean, you've got that, you got the Octane or, or the, uh, 
what they call it, the Arsenal. And you got the X-Wing, the Man of War. The Imperius line had some really unique um, designs for sure. There's a blue label Venom. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In the high polish? Yep, high polish. Beautiful. Yeah. This thing is magnificent. Yeah, that, that's some good color on that one. Woo! <laughs> well, okay. And you know what that is? Yep. Kraken 8040. Yep. Kraken 8040N. I got the red and black. I think Godfather talked me into that color. Yes, I know Godfather <laughs> loves red and black. He was saying, I said, which one should I get? He said, get the red and black. And I did. So thanks, Godfather, for the tip. I know he loves that color. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> oh, here we go. A giant excursion with diamonds. Blue Mother of Pearl. Okay. Yeah. So oh. I got the, the diamonds on the hour markers? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, it, that, that's a heavy watch. This that's is a, heavy. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I actually have mine on, and uh, I'll, uh, I got the scales right here. So, I'll, so mine weighs out at 13 ounces on that Grand Excursion. It It's a big boy. <laughs> and we got a 47 millimeter full of diamonds, abalone. Oh, nice. Bottles. Yep. Yeah. That. Yeah, with that with the cabochon on the yep. on the crown, that's nice. Yep. Yeah. That's a beauty. That's a good one. Yep. And that's two nope. tone actually. Okay. Now what do you what do you have back there? Do you have like eight slot, fifteen slot? What do you got going back there? I got three fifteen slots. Okay. And then I got about uh, eight eight slots. Got it. And I got some three slots. No, I got one. I got like three more eight slots on the side over okay. here. And then I got a couple of three slots, but not too much in there. Yeah. Uh, I I I like the those new fifteens are nice because oh, they're great. You, yeah, I mean you really can get some you know a, a good size in it. Here's my uh, Turbion. When the I think it was the first one that came out. Yeah, well, yeah, one of the, yeah, uh, the Sass Turby, yeah. The Sass Turby, all gold. Yeah. Polish. Well, yeah, with the blue. Um, um, that blue. Uh, sundial. Yeah, yeah, sundial like. Yeah. What's nice. my go-to piece? Uh, my go-to piece. I would say. I would say. I'll go with a Bolt Zeus Magnum. <laughs> well you know you can't say he's not playing to the crowd i'll give him that yeah i'm a crowd pleaser you know uh, coalition force sandstone dial with the diamonds on the bezel oh yeah you know yeah. i know i know vic picked this one up yeah whoever so, missed uh, out on godfather right. godfather's getting on the uh on, on the bandwagon a little bit here he's asking uh what how how many uh how many that need to be sized <laughs> uh i'll answer honestly because you know i'm notorious for not sizing my watches so oh they're, they're well you're not the only one there's a few out there you know i mean there's there's some big collectors that probably got probably got more uh to be sized than you but have at <laughs> I, I got about fifteen, Godfather. I'm watching. That's not on. bad. No, no, that's not bad. I no, think 15. Mark. I think Mark Hines is up around eighty or ninety. Because I took a few la a few weeks ago. I went back to the guy because of COVID. You know, I waited right. and all that stuff, and I took it, and he did them. So I'm going to go back and bring him a fifteen slot. Maybe he'll do eight of them. So, yeah. uh, your favorite, John? Oh yeah, yeah. I yeah, the the uh, the bolt Zeus without the cable, yeah. Yeah, just on the just on the top, yeah. Yep. 
Beautiful. I love this watch. Yeah. The uh, yeah the dial work on that. I, I love the detail that they did with that with that dagger and everything. Yeah. I that's that's probably one of my top five in the Punishers. Yep. Beautiful. Sure. I love it. Yeah. That's a good one. Okay. Who's a Star Wars fan? Sea Hunter, Tie Fighter. Oh Woo. yeah. Yeah Thank yeah. You. Huge, huge. Yeah. Look yeah. at this puppy. Yep. But it's 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 nice though because you really get a lot of dial play that you can do. Oh yeah, all the details. Yeah. Yeah. That's nice. Very nice watch. Welcome, Rico. Welcome, Hi, Rico. Welcome. And of course, <laughs> we know what that is. Oh yeah, Grand Diver with the uh, Stingray. Yep, the stingray strap, and I got the wife one as well. Yeah. Uh, which one did I miss in this box? Yeah, come on. There, there's you. You're you're not the only one out there that's uh, Star Wars fans. I can tell you, there's quite a few of us out here that have uh, have a couple of them. That's for sure. Okay, here we go. Oh, there you go. Yeah. Well, glad. This is a beast, I tell you. Beautiful watch, though, with the chain. Oh, yeah. Beautiful. Now, I've, I haven't gotten one yet, but I've heard the uh, the the bracelet and everything. It it, it actually is is quite you know comfortable the way they uh, designed the uh, lug system and everything. Okay, the Vortes. I don't know how many of you got it, but. Uh, now is that the interchangeable? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Yep. I so, think Vic, I think Vix got it. Uh, got one or two of those. Uh, I I I missed out on those. I I may go back next time and and grab one. Okay. There we go with an excursion with the chunky bezel. Oh yeah, the, yeah. With the new one with the new bezel design, and everything. Yeah, I think I like this that. one. This one came out before the, the 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 last one. Oh, okay, okay. Real nice. Yeah. Real funky roadstone. Beautiful. Yeah. That's tall in the saddle too. That that thing sets up quite a bit. It sure does. I mean, wow. Yeah. What is that? Uh, I'd guess 15, 15 e mil maybe. Fifteen, easy. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh. Is a Swiss made master calendar hybrid. Kind of hybrid. Yep, love it. Yeah, yeah, I love those. Yep. yeah. And so, Kimo said the Vortes was his very first Invicta that he got back in 2011. That's nice. Nice. There we go. Interchangeable straps. Okay, so that's what I was going to ask you. Is that the interchangeables? Yeah. Yep, I got a black and a red right now. <laughs> okay. On there. That's a good. That's a good combo. Yep. Here's a, uh, a what is this? A specialty. It's just a, a regular yeah. specialty came out. Yeah. I picked it up. It's got a nice bracelet on it. Yeah, that's a nice link design. I like that. Um. Yeah, the side. Hey, DC. Uh, hey, Jay Moore. Welcome, welcome. Trying to watch. Okay. Okay, some puppies now. Oh, okay. Uh, there we go. Puppy sass. Blue, yellow, red. Got it. And the Herc puppy, turquoise. Herc puppy. Yep. I know yeah. when this came out, I grabbed it quick. <laughs> yeah. Even yeah, this that one. Yeah, that that's a nice that, that's that's some that's some good color combos on that, for sure. Okay, fifteenth anniversary Russian diver with the mother of pearl. Oh yeah, beautiful. Yeah, and this was that uh, signature series, and that came out before the reserve, correct? Uh, yeah, yeah, I, I believe that's what they called it before. Yeah, Reserve was the signature series. I think Godfather was saying that. Yeah. If I quite remember. Uh, 
There's an Akula automatic. Oh, yeah, Prestige. Yeah, I like those. Those are yeah, nice. Very nice. I know Trap loves his Akulas. Yeah, Rico. Rico's a big Akula guy, too. And here's the, uh, the Venom with the shiny case back. Oh, okay, Gen 2. Gen 2, yeah. Yeah, you don't see a lot of Gen 2s uh, out and about. On, especially on the strap, like they're 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 a little bit tougher to find nowadays. Now is that is that the GMT? Yes, GMT. Okay, so the five one five. Yep. Yeah. About two four eight. Yep. Yep. Yeah, that that's a nice. I, I, I like that movement. And here we go to Venom Chain the Blue Label. Oh yeah. Yeah. That that one I I've got that 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 same blue label one and it takes a little bit you know to kind of fiddle with getting the the the, the linkage set on it but once you do it's super comfortable. The it bracelet is. is so so easy and on the on the arm and very fluid. Yeah, I like that one a lot. Oh, okay. Godfather's got the Prestige Akula with the Turbion. Nice. Nice. Wow. And here we go, anatomic. So that's straight anatomic, right? Yes. Okay. And yeah. uh, Trap ena enabled me on this one. <laughs> yeah. I'm blaming him. He did. Okay. Hey, but it's a good know. thing. <laughs> it's always good to enable somebody. Always, always good. Always good to share the love, right? Yes. <laughs> there we go. One of your favorites, John. I know you like this hydro. Oh yeah, the yeah the gut yeah it was one of the first hydro dips they ever did. Yep, with the yellow. Yeah. And four millimeter cable. Yeah, it looks like yep. four or five. Uh, I think it's a four. If off the top of my head, I want to say four. But uh, it could be five. I mean, it's you know it's nice. Still running. Oh yeah. Still running. Uh mm huh. -hmm. I pull the crowns a lot, but she's still running. All right, a couple of X wings, blue label, and a rosestone X wing. One's reserved. One, this is re, this is reserved. This right. is not. Okay. So uh, Godfather's asking, how many blue labels do you have? Do you have? I have about. One? I have eight blue labels. Eight. Okay. Eight or nine. Yeah, that hey that that's that's a good blue label count. Okay. And Jay Moore They're saying his the Turbion is next on his list after the sub oh uh, yeah, because I know he's been looking for a sub three. So Yeah. Yeah. The, the Turbions are, are, are nice. I I I like I like that movement. It it's pretty wild. They're real nice. I mean I got a couple myself, but Oh yeah, Rico was talking about that 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 Magnum going back to the Magnum. So there was like three colors. There was that one color that you had. There was a blue and white that looked like water drops, and then there was oh, Vic, help me out. What was the third of those Hydra Dip Magnums? <laughs> I cannot remember the third color. I want to say it was it was a full yellow, but I'm not 100. percent Anyway, go ahead. Sorry. Oh, no, go ahead. You know, I don't want to, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, we're good. There you oh, go. Yeah. Okay. okay. Blue label. Is that, is that the, the Z60 in that one? Uh, Yes, it is. Okay. Yep. I love it. Yeah. Yeah, th those are nice. Can be, a, they, they can be, they the Grand Octanes can be a little tricky if you're not paying attention sizing them just because of the pin and collar. But uh, I do love the fit that they, that, that you can get with it. So, right. black label eighty forty in. Yes, yes, I love it. That's a nice one. Yeah, Beautiful. Jay. Jay Moore's like my value pays are crazy. Yeah, amen, buddy. <laughs> Aren't most of ours? <laughs> All of ours. <laughs> okay, Rico. Yeah, there was the gun metal, and that's what you have. Then there was a yellow and a blue. Yep. Thanks, Rico. Okay, here we go. Oh, the um, 
Sea Monster. Yes. Yeah. Subak was Sea Monster. Yeah. They need to do a... So, the way they've got, like, those torpedo tubes and everything, they yeah. definitely need to do a Navy version of that. Do a, a Navy watch with that. Yes. Because of the whole submarine theme. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Godfather's sake, waiting on them to put a, a, a tourbillon in, in a pocket watch. Yeah, that would be... That, that that's going to be special. Yeah. That's going to be special. Oh, oh, Sea Dragon. Yeah. Thank you, Sheldon. And welcome, Sheldon. If I, okay. Since I missed you coming in. Bolts, Bolt Zeus Magnum Graffiti. Oh, yeah. Let me see. The lighting's just a little too... There you go. A little better. Yeah, yeah that's a good one. That's got some good color to it, too. Bolt Zeus Graffiti. Okay. Is that the original silver, the white dial? Yes, this is the silver white okay. dial with the blue uh, trim. Yep. On the sub dials. Okay. Yep. Real nice. Yeah. Yeah, those are those, those are some of my favorites in, in the Zeus. Heavy, heavy. Yeah, yeah, Zeus's are up there, probably about the same. I'd say a, a Zeus is going to run you 11, 12 ounces, roughly. So, yeah, you're definitely going to know what's on your wrist. Okay, is the Herc with the 8040N, the first one that came out? Well, the first one was a Z60. Yeah. Then they came out with the 8040N, and that's when I grabbed it. Yeah. Well, the black and the rose. Yeah, yeah, stone. yeah. Yeah, that's Beautiful. that's a nice co yeah black and rose. I, I love that color combo. That's a good one. Bolt Zeus Magnum Rose Tone. I mean Bolt Zeus. <laughs> Bolt <Yeah>. Zeus. <laughs> yep. Uh, and that brown is that brown mother of pearl? Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah. That you don't see a lot of brown mother of pearl. Th those those come around very few times. Yep, I grabbed this puppy. Oh yeah. Yep. <laughs> well, Vic, you're not mentioning too much in the chat, so you must be looking up occasionally. Yeah, he is. <laughs> and here's the Gen 3 bolt with that new uh, bracelet. Oh, yeah. With that yeah, new glass uh, yeah. pin. Yeah, that bracelet's nice. I really like that bracelet, the way they did it with the little raised hump on the... Yeah. Uh, on the insides. It's like a five link, isn't it? Uh, if I'm looking at yeah. it right. Or at least it's, it's yep. made to look like a five link. It, 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 yeah, it looks like a five link. Yeah. But uh, beautiful. Yeah, that, yeah that, that's that one. The, the, the bolt line is, I mean, it, it's amazing all the, you know, I mean, of course you can say that about a lot of the lines, but I mean, it, it's amazing how long that one's been a lot around and where it all started and how many lines came off of that. I mean, you've got the Zeus, you've got the Tria, you've got Magnum. I mean, there's a lot of, there's a, a lot of variations in, in the bolt line for sure. Okay. Pro Diver Sea Hunter. Blue label. Okay. The 52 with the spinning. Yes. The three yep. propellers. Yeah. Yeah, it is three. Yep. And yeah. I can thank Sheldon for <laughs> he enabled me on this one, but he told me to cancel one with a strap. It was another watch, and he said, get this one. And I'm glad I did. Yeah. So, Sheldon, thank you for your uh, professional advice. <laughs> <laughs> so so godfather's asking because he, he may have missed it so what year exactly did you start with invicta um i started in 2015 2015 okay that's about the same time i did yeah 2015 a lot later than he did <laughs> <laughs> uh, well you can i mean that that's that's pretty much almost anybody in this is chat i mean godfather's been 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 rocking the style for a long time. Very long time. Venom Chain Dragon. Oh, yeah. 
Yeah. I, I love the when they did that with the uh, with that inner bezel ring, uh, with with that uh, kind of like that that uh, open weaved rope style. Yeah, that I, yeah. I love that design. And the links on this are so heavy. Yeah, yeah, it's they a thick one. So thick. Yeah, I think they're probably about six. I think six six and a half mil thickness on those. They're 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 beefy. And the rose tone, the scales going down. Down, I mean, down the this middle. Watch was, this watch was cheap when I got it. Yeah. It wasn't that much money. Yeah. And then I got the uh, Venom and Silver Tone. Okay. It's got that same. Oh, yeah. With, on, on, on the, yeah. On the mesh chain. Nice. On the mesh chain. And they got this bracelet. Yeah. So. Cool, cool. That's a couple more there. So Jay Moore saying he started in 09. Sheldon saying he started in 99 uh, when his son was born. Now I'm going to show you the first. <laughs> Godfather. Uh, now I'm going to show you the first four watches I got when I started. Okay. All right. So, so this, this, is, this is the old school section here, right? No, nah, not that old. <laughs> Well, they're yeah, old. I, I didn't say they were old. I'm just saying that's that's your old school, you know, your vintage looks. Okay, my first Invicta watch, an elegant uh, little pro diver here. I like the bracelet on that. That that's nice. The that that double two tone in there. Yep. And uh, as you can see, I I you know wore it down a little, <laughs> scratched up the bottom. <laughs> Don't put your wrist on the desk. Yeah. Yeah. You know, you just don't learn. Then I got a uh, scuba here. I got this little pro diver scuba. Yeah. I mean, they're, they're, but they're classic and they're comfortable. I mean, it, uh, I mean, it's a, it's a, you know, it's not an elaborate bracelet, but just the way they, they do the links with that little bit of an up sweep. Is just you know, it's just a little different. That's what that's what's so nice about them is, yeah. There's just a, it's not it's not straight across. It's not linear. There's just like a, a little you know upsweep to it, which it's 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 amazing. And this one I got. This is like an elegant diver. It's got a Swiss Edda movement in it. Oh, okay. Uh, nice. It's got the three little sub dials. I mean. Yeah, that's a nice yep. one. Leather strap and look how small. Was that about 44, small, 47? Yeah, it's about a 44 millimeter. Okay. Hey, Meat and I, welcome to the show. Welcome. Hi, Meat. And now the Sea Spider. That was the fourth watch I bought. Oh, yeah. Mechanical uh, wind up, all that. Still running. Yeah. But sizing this it was, <laughs> wasn't too much fun, man. <laughs> yeah, I've done. Uh, I've done. I got about three or four of the sea spiders, and yeah, the the double screws, and then you know, uh, Smitten has a bunch of the uh, uh -huh. slim case Sabaco Normal ones, and they all come double screw. Yeah, they can be uh, challenging on the nerves. <laughs> Got to have you. Got you, you got to you got to really calm down. Take a little sip of tequila. Get your get your hands from shaking, so you don't so you don't scratch nothing. <laughs> uh huh. Yeah. <laughs> There's a Speedway Viper. Uh, oh yeah. It's got the silicone strap there. Gray. Yeah. Yeah. Green little dial little, abalone. Holsters on it. Yeah, that's nice. Yep. Got this a little while. Yeah, that's a good one. Here's an S1 Rally that. Uh, let me see if I can get the dial to show. Oh yeah, with the uh, with the with the silicon that wraps around it. Yep. I love that. I love that design. I mean, it's just it's just so different. Of course, I'd, I'd hate to think you know if you know if you got to replace one of those straps, uh, it's going to be a bit of a bit of a workout. But yeah, yeah. It, I, I love the design and look of it. It's got the white mother pearl dial like. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. Godfather saying he's got one of the original sea spiders that had the big, 
Spider, I think it was like down around the uh, seven, eight o'clock. I think, if I remember right, those are really those are cool. I like those. There's a Venom, all black, silicone strap. It's got that uh, little. Uh, the, coat uh, oh, black mother pearl. I'm trying to remember the name of that Venom. It's it's a Venom something. Uh, let me see on the back. What's it say? It's it a, say, it's a, no, not, not Venom Predator. No, it just says Venom. It's not, it's not a fang. No, it's got the, you can see the Cobra. Yeah. Cobra silicone strap. Yeah. This is a Gen 1 for sure. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, let's see the case back. Uh, uh, so it's a Gen 2 case back, but yeah, it, it's. No, not not Sea Dragon. Uh, I don't see. I'd have to look it up on my yeah. I'm, I'm, I'll on my spreadsheet, but yeah. Uh, fats. Um, I I say I I haven't counted. I'm probably around. I'm between two fifty two sixty somewhere in there. Woo. <laughs> Give or take. I mean, I know I'm, I'm within a couple. I'm not too far off. Let me put these back. Uh, oh, the name of that one's going to drive me crazy until I get it. I'll, I'll get it. I'll remember it here. I got my spreadsheet somewhere, but I won't. Yeah, well, yeah, I've, I've got right on, I got mine on my other computer. Beautiful Coalition Forces. Dragon yeah, the Dragon. Crystals. Now... I'll go off on a little bit of a tangent, right? All right. And for anybody that has those King Cobras or the Venom Cobras, you'll you'll know what I'm talking about. So if you look at the detail of that dragon, right, with the the wings and the face and the tail and all of that, the one thing that was to me that was a, a little disappointing was that um the detail on that one on the on that viper that they had inside around the mouth kind of fell a little flat to me but oh uh pappy uh someone's asking uh fats collections is asking uh what your count is now uh 235 okay 235. I want to hit 250 pretty soon so I can call in and uh, have a celebration. Yeah, yeah. Yep. Uh, make sure it's a uh, Sunday night, pretty much power play night. Yeah, well, or you could do a Thursday, like a like the collector's night. That might be a good one. That might be a good, better idea. You know. I'll have more than you, Godfather, in the next couple of months. Uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, he's got a unique collection, Godfather. I mean, Godfather, unique... yeah. I, I, I mean, I don't care. I don't care who's out there and who you, how many you've got. Um, Godfather's been doing it a long time. But unlike some of us crazies that got, you know, the uh, the Invicta fever and went a little goofy, um, and uh, you know, bought bought a, a boatload. Godfather has been unique and distinctive from the get-go. So, oh, the uh, turbine. The, yeah, the turbine. Yep. Remember that? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. They've done a, quite a few different variations of that. They had the whole uh, uh, hard rock with the uh, roulette wheel. They did similar to that. They've had a couple turbines. I think they did one in like a S1 Speedway. They had a turbine. Yeah, right. there, there's a couple good ones out there. Definitely a uh, fidget worthy. Oh yeah. Remember this Deadpool? Yeah, the Deadpool in that in that design with the red and the black. Yeah. Yep. That S1. one's nice. That's yep. yeah. That one's super cool. Definitely cool. <laughs> okay. So Jay Moore's talking about he's done 38 in 12 years. There's nothing wrong with that, Jay Moore. I mean. Yep. Be, yeah. Being selective, hey, that that's what it's all about. Because a collection is is unique to you, and and what moves you, and uh, 
it's not it's not all about numbers it's appreciating each watch for what it is and how it speaks to you so yeah now i appreciate it. hey kenny stopping by no worries interview early in the morning hey uh break a leg and everything else uh on on the interview tomorrow so you know good vibes coming your way man i'm sure you're gonna knock it out of the park thanks for stopping by kenny yeah appreciate it, kenny Okay, so, oh, okay, New York Giants, the... Pro, um, pro Diver. Yeah, okay, yep, yep. Yep, that's when they first came out. Yeah, yeah, that was the first, that was one of the first two. Hey, Heimdall, welcome, welcome. Sith Trooper. Oh, okay, okay. Automatic. Red and black. Yep. Got it last Christmas. Yeah. Yeah, that's that's a good one. So she's a year what, old already. What number you got on that one? Uh, let me look real quick. I'll tell you what number. I got number. Let me see here. A little hard in the light here. <laughs> Sorry about that. No, that's fine. I, I, um, sprung, I sprung that one on you. <laughs> Zero four two seven. That's a good one. Yeah, that's a good number. Yeah, not bad. No, that's pretty good. Not not bad at and all. Yeah, I mean, you know, I have to say for for all of the collections out there, you know, because you've got like Marvel, DC, Disney, all of that. For for all of the ones that are out there, and they have a lot of um, you know standardized you know kind of numberings like. Marvel is usually in the threes. DCs are in the four. I think Mickey's are four to fives. The fact that they did Star Wars in 1977, which is, you know, the homage to the first movie coming out, I think was one, I think it makes it, you know, more limited, obviously it makes them more unique, but it, it, it I, I love how they tie in, you know, all of those details as, you know, part of the experience, you know, of getting a, a Star Wars piece. So, Right. Super cool. Here we go with a tinted excursion. Oh, yeah, the tinted excursion. Titanium look. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, I love that look. Yeah. And I, I love the, uh, the the AB buttons on that, the way that they've designed them with that, with that kind of sweep that follows the case. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, super cool design. Yeah, right there. Yeah, love that those. That was cool. Pretty heavy, too. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it, it has a titanium look, but yeah, it's uh, it definitely on the uh, the the big steel size. Yeah. So. so she's running. Uh, let's see. About the NCA. Uh, so Spinner G is asking about the NCA. I know that I believe and um, Trap, check me on this because I I I think he's been following us a little bit. Um, I think that they've signed a deal. I believe they, they've, they've signed a negotiation and they're working on designs. And I think the initial run is going to, Oh, okay. There is no news yet. Okay. My bad. I was thinking they had a run of that. They had about 20, like it was going to be like the top 25 school, something like that, give or take. But yeah, they, they may still be, you know, working it out because, of course, depending on how that governing body, you still have to deal with, I think, the individual schools. Um, MLB. Oh, my goodness. Um, I, I remember AL said something on the cruise on the 2020 about that. Uh, and for the life of me, I cannot remember. There was one of them. It was either NBA or MLB that already had uh, a signed gig with somebody, so that one was automatically out. I think it was the NBA, but I could be backwards. Um, but yeah, I haven't, I haven't heard anything specific. Of course, you know that was, you know, the 2020 cruise, and of course, you know, we all know what that that went, you know, totally sideways. Oh, okay. The deal, so the, yeah, the NCAA, the deal was was inked, 
but then, um, yeah, everything about the uh, about the vid, um, you know, halted the actual executions of it. So I think they're probably, uh, I'd say maybe they may be starting to spin it up now. Hopefully. So Godfather's saying that he doesn't have uh, any with any of the sports teams. That's fine, Godfather. That's fine. I'd still, I'd still take your. Uh... Okay, yeah, the NBA has the watch companies in there already. That's. I, I was thinking it was the NBA, but uh, I don't have any. I don't have any sports teams either, um, Godfather. So, you know, what's Rico saying? Rico plating on the Black Panther Zeus doing a video on okay awesome awesome looks like black titanium or bead blast much more matte than regular okay cool cool I hope you're hope you're uh, feeling better too Rico I know you've been um, in and out with uh, with some of your you know health issues so um, can't wait to see it but also understand you know life and things can can get in the way so they uh you know we we can all wait on you to be ready when you do oh, okay nhl was the other one they talked about oh, okay sorry peppy i got distracted uh go no ahead, problem man. what you got going uh, no problem. You know, you you run the show. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you know? yeah, you're 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 the guest. You're the one showing everything. I'm just oh, here, I know. I'm just here getting stuff done. <laughs> I'm just here making sure we you know we all we all you know play by the rules. So I got you. <laughs> uh, all right, here's the trap. Thank you for your service, trap. Here's the uh, four time zone titanium case. Yes. Yeah, I, I love that one. Uh, yeah, that the pure titanium. Yep. I love. I love. I have that one. I I love that watch. That one is super cool. Real Absolutely cool. love that one. Lightweight. Yeah. Yeah. The Venom Joker, the first one. Oh, that came out okay. This is so this is this is OG. This is the original on yes, the strap. Sir. Yep. That's yeah. OG. Yeah. Look at that green. Beautiful. So uh, Godfather's asking if you've got any C base. C base. I have one, I think. Okay. Okay. I have one C base. Yes. Good deal. Good deal. Uh, now here's one. I asked Ryan to bring it back. I think it did come back. The uh, Diablo Master Calendar. Oh, yeah. Remember this? Yeah, yeah. It came yeah. yellow and some other color. Yeah, I want to say there was a yellow, a blue, a black, that red. Um, there may have been another one. I can't remember. But, but yeah, I, I love the master calendar in that one. It it, it really fits the, the scale of that watch. I love really it. Well. Yeah. And the, the uh, yeah, the, the, the sub adjusters. Yep. Yeah, those are nice. Great watch. Here's one for you. To know S1 Rally on the Oh, on the leather. Leather yeah. Spot. yeah, with that with that kind of uh talk to leather look like uh like they used to do on uh on the seats. Yeah, on the uh, yeah, old school uh resto mods and stuff. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Silver tone, beautiful. Yeah, that one's nice. Yeah, I love that case and the the grid size on the nine o'clock side. Yeah, mm -hmm. that plate. Yeah. So Fats is saying his first was a Speedway nineteen five two nine. Trying to remember that one. Woo, that's old. That yeah, that's going back a day. That's <laughs> a good one. <laughs> yeah, we got Bolt Spider Man. Here you go, oh, okay. Spider Man. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Nice. Yeah, nice. The, yeah. The the blue on that is definitely up there with the uh, with the blue labels, especially when they do it in that high polish. That's mm -hmm. super nice. 
Yeah, got the crown pulled out, you know, saved the okay. battery. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> There's a little uh, aviator I got uh, as a gift. So okay. That can yeah. Now, is that an auto in there, or is it, or is those, I could. No, it's a quartz. Oh, okay, it's the quartz, okay. Yeah. It's got the four okay. sub dials. Okay. Here's a little, uh, little pro diver. Simple. Yeah. Very simple. Uh, it's got the polyurethane strap. I mean, I don't like it too much, but that's what they had, and I got it because it came with an eight slot, I think. Oh, okay. So in the beginning, I would get a watch with eight slots, and that's how I how built you my store. them, yeah, yeah. I, uh, so I remember I bought the um, the Russian was it Russian aviators or something like that, and they came in those uh, blue and black um, ten slot uh, boxes. I remember that was the the that was I bought that like right after I bought my my first one, which is that Venom. Because I wanted to have something to, to put them in, because I was like, I, you know, I, I need something to put these in. And I was like, I'll I'll never fill those up. I mean, I, those, that that'll that'll serve me forever. <laughs> it was like, I don't know, six eight months, and I was like, oh man, I need to buy some more cases. <laughs> Unbelievable. Yeah, it 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 gets ahead of you. Here we have the. Uh... Grand okay. Diver. Now, now is that uh, is that the, the uh fifty fifty C or mm -hmm. or am I getting it wrong? I always get the one with the date and window in the middle. I always I always screw that that movement up. But yeah, I love that uh that design where it's got the the day of the week right there On at the center it. and the two big date dial. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Those are nice. I like that movement, but I'm sure I probably screwed up the name. So. No, I think you got it right. I think it's got okay. a 5050 C in there. Okay. And this one came with a QA tag, which was rare. Remember, I was explaining to you one time. Uh, uh, they come with these QA little tags. Inside oh, yeah, yeah. There. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. And they filled out. Here we go. Sand 6, Aquaman. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I'm, I'm, you know, I, I have to say it, it, it's been a minute since I've, since I've seen an Aquaman. I don't think uh, helium release and everything. Yeah, yeah. That's nice. And I got the case with it, the green uh, Aquaman case. Oh, you got the three slot that came with it? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Those are nice. I'm, I'm curious when they're going to start pulling some more DC characters, um, and bringing them across. Cause there's so many good characters out there that they could, they could put in some watches and, uh, you know, I'll be curious to see what they start, you know, really going with. I mean, there's all kinds of like, you know, I mean, they did Wonder Woman, but you've got like, you know, Catwoman. They did, you know, Harley Quinn, but that was, they did it in like one design. But, uh, yeah, there, there's, there's a lot of DC that they could really work on. True. Grand Subaqua Iridescent. Master Calendar. Nice. Master, yep. Master Calendar. That's I love nice the case one. back on this one. Now that's a case back. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yeah, that's a good one. Yeah. That's beautiful. Woo. Yeah. Yeah, it, it it's amazing. Like you say, you know, outside of, you know, us sitting around, you know, talking and everything and showing watches, you know, no one's really ever going to know it. But some of the case backs they do on some of these watches are just absolutely amazing. Um, there's um, the Sabaco Noma one, some of the older ones. It's all like uh, raised, you know, textured on the back with, you know, all kinds of information um of course you got the nemi and lion and uh, the sub threes have quite a few there's some really nice case backs out there it's super nice oh there's a good question what's the best case back wow wow that's <laughs> a um whew. i really love 
the Platinum Select case back where they did the, uh, it was like the rubberized um, like wax seal like the, you would have on an old letter. I like that one a lot. Um, the one that that I really want it's 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 a grail that I'm trying to is the Apollo that they did uh, back in the day. That one is definitely on my list of ones to get. Uh, the Koi is a really good one. Um, so yeah, there there's a couple super amazing case backs out there. The new Bolt Zeus Graffiti in the light blue. Okay, the blue, yeah. Just got that the other day. Yeah, that's a that's a nice coloration. I like that. Yeah. And it's got the blue sub dials. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, that's Beautiful. that's that's a good one. Woo! Wow. Good weight too. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, Zeus Zeus are always up there. I'd say a Zeus generally is gonna be around ten eleven. So you 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 know you got something on your wrist when you got Zeus on. Oh yeah, yeah. iridescent seven. in the seven. Yep. Yeah. Look at that case now, back. Th now there you go. There's a I, I like that case back on that. You know you've got that the texture on the on the bezel on the the beveled edge and then all of the sabacqua in the center. That's a, mm -hmm. that's a good detailed case back for sure. Yep. Wow, so the so Godfather does not have an Apollo. I could have sworn I would have thought you would have had one. But yeah, that uh, the Apollo is definitely one that I want to try and get um, for sure. Just because I mean, it's it. There's just something about you know the 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 fact of of celebrating that is, is just so unique. Almost urban camo, yeah, almost. Okay, the Stingray in the Gen Stingray. 3. Yeah. I know Godfather likes this one. Yeah, yeah. I I, I love that ocean. I wish they would have continued it because they stopped at those three, and I really wish there was there was at least a good two or three, maybe even four more designs they could have done. But I, I, lo I love those things. I've got – so I've got the, uh, the Seahorse, the uh, – what was it? The octopus, and then and then this one, and uh, the the stingray. I, I love I love that design. It's so so neat the way they did that. What's on the case back on that one? Is, uh, it, is, it, is it just standard sub three or? It, yeah, standard sub aqua. Okay, okay. I couldn't remember. Dragon. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yep. Right there. Yeah. High polish. Nice. Hi, Paulus. Yep. Here's one for you that was uh, a good deal. The NH38A Dragon Reserve. Yeah. The open heart. Yeah. Open heart. Yeah, that's a. And I, I I love the bezel on that one. The way they did that with the scaling is uh is super cool. Yep. Almost like the it's it, it mimics the 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 spine on him. I think I wanted oh. the red one, but I got. I got this one. Right. So Elwin's asking, uh, what grail are you, or what's on your grail list, I should say, because I'm sure you've got more than one. <laughs> I know I do. A Turby meteorite with diamonds. Okay. Okay. Yep. Yeah. I'll go, yeah. I'll second that one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll second that one. And, uh, I still got to get the dual open heart. I've got to get that one. Okay. There is a few I missed, so. <laughs> yeah. We will show. Uh, which the... one? Because there was a cup. So there was the, they did it in the Venom, and then they did it in the, uh, was it S1? I think I want the S1. The S1? Okay. Is the Thanos. There yeah. Venom Thanos, everybody. Yep. Got a good number. All right. Yeah. Did they do anything on the case back or not really? Just their not, standard Marvel? Uh, standard. But yeah. Yep. Yeah, just the yeah, Marvel emblem. Okay. And, and I think it's a mineral crystal on that or no, Is that's it? Flame, flame Fusion. Okay. 
There's the Venom with the interchangeable straps. Yeah, yeah, yeah. With, the, with these pins. Yep, yep. Push them out. Yep. I think yeah, I that, uh, yeah, Greek. I was talking about that Grand Zeus. Yeah, that Grand Zeus was was nice. I, I love when they uh, when when they brought the uh, that big cable system out. Okay, now there's a there's a radar radar. That's Woo! like a real radar. Yes. Straight up radar. Yeah. I love Remember that. They called them radar. The other one, and no, this is the radar. Yeah, that. Yeah, that's a radar. The other ones are tinted crystal, and I, I wish they wouldn't. Yeah, I wish they wouldn't mix those around. But yeah, you know. Heavy watch, beautiful. Yeah. So Sheldon's saying that uh, he's uh, encouraging you that you want him in both. <laughs> <laughs> I want them both, huh? <laughs> want them both. Let me let me get some more here. Yeah. So God, okay, Godfather's got the uh, the S one version in the uh, dual open heart. All right, let's move along here. Star Wars X-Wing. X-Wing uh, Distressed. Yes. Gun metal. Love, I love that one. That one that one is so amazing. I, I love when they did that one. Yes, Trap, you're right about the case back on the Thanos should be engraved. Yep. Yeah. Got that one. Remember this deal? The Russian diver. It was like a it was like an elegant version or something, or just like a simple three hand or something. Uh, it's actually a retro grade. Uh, oh, the retro. Okay. Yeah, Candy had showed this, and it was like real cheap. Came with an eight slot. Right. And I grabbed it. Yeah. Beautiful. Rose tone. Yeah. Oh, Knight saying he has he has both of them. So Knight, if you've got both, you got the S1 and, and the Venom. Um, which one has uh, bigger dial play? I think the uh, the S1 has a slightly bigger dial play, but I, I could be off on that. Here you go, the cage. Yeah. With the leather strap. Yep. Yep. Yeah. Very nice. Yeah, that, that super cool design. I, I I love that. I love that design. The S one. Yeah. That's what, that's what I thought too. That it was slightly the the way the 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 bezel and everything was. It was slightly bigger uh, dial face. Oh yeah, Rick. I I seriously. Okay, so that's the Chatham and Dover. Yes. And guess what number I have. It was only 150 made, so which number do I have? If you got 150, I may be driving to New York and uh, helping you out, helping you out with that one. I have 150. Do you? Yep. Yeah. I'll show it to you. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. No, no. I, I, I believe you. I, uh, <laughs> yeah. Of, of, of all the things out there, um, one of the grails that that I really have is that. I get the last of it, and I actually got lucky. I uh, it was the uh, the cruise watch from was it 2020? Sure. It might have been 2020. It was a Venom from the cruise watch, and I think it was like either 150 or 200. I can't remember. And I actually have the last one, the the whatever. The, I think it's 200. And uh, yeah, I I. I mean, you know, number ones I think are very unique and everything, but to me, there's something about having that very last number. It's just to me, it's just it's just super cool. Yeah. Or or a number, I'll say a number that has like a real significance at the time. So when we went on the 2018 cruise, there was like four watches available to buy on the ship, and uh, there was. Um, I think it was two Venoms. Uh, it was a um, Open Heart Man of War and something else. And uh, I actually got number 28 of 100 because it was our 28th anniversary. Wow. That year. So, 
you know. It actually it was funny. I actually had number 19, and we were walking around and everything, and this, this, this older gentleman was coming, and he was asking what, you know, if anybody wanted to trade, and because uh, he was, and number 19 was, I think it was like his son was just turned 19 or something, and I'm like, and I, he told me what it was, and I was like, yeah, yeah. I mean, it was a little bit higher number, but it was more significant, you know, because I, like I said, it was our twenty. That year was our twenty eighth anniversary. So I was like, yeah, absolutely, totally amazing. Hey, Brian, what's going on, buddy? There's one Dragon Lupa. Okay, with the yeah. with the uh, with the strap. Yep, got the strap. Got this special strap. This funky strap. Yes. Yeah. Remember that? Buoyant system. Yep, it's got the pin and all that. Yeah. Yeah, I, I, they're, they're a bit funky to get right the first time, but yeah, once you get it set, um, everyone that I talk to uh, about that, because of the way that you're doing it, uh, it really saves the leather because you're not stretching and doing that all the time. It, it turns it into that bracelet functionality. That it really saves the uh, the leather a lot of wear and tear. Beautiful watch. Beautiful. Yeah, yeah. Love love that design for sure. Yep. Okay. Let's see what else. Well, I'm rocking the uh, hybrid tourbillon. Oh yeah, all silver with all the silver. Uh, platinum mother of pearl. Uh, yep. Yep. So I got that on size. Yeah. It's size. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, coming back, coming back. I mean, I got a lot of watches. <laughs> That's all right. Hey. Is your favorite? Okay, Hydra Max. There you go. OG, you know? Yeah, yep. Yeah. With the black? Yeah. And GMT? Yep. 515.24H. Yeah, the only thing I wish they did on those Hydromaxes, I wish the uh, the lug system had just a little bit more curvature instead of that flat line to it. Exactly. Um, but other than that, yeah, I, I and I, I will say every Hydromax so far that I've ever seen and, and that I've talked to is that the uh, links are folded. Right. They're not solid links. Or at least the ones I've seen. I'll put it to you that way. Okay. Pro Diver Open Heart. Here nice. Go, crap. Yeah, that's a good one. Remember that movement, Miota? So, okay. The, yeah, the Miota. Yeah. I got two of them. Yeah, that, that's a good looking watch for sure. And I, I tell you, it's really, really, um, the dial got a lot going on. Yeah. Yeah. It, it Yeah. It's got enough detail, but it's not so busy that you can't that you can't really read it easily. Right. Let me get another one. Got a few more here. So Brian's going to post a uh, new video of his uh, first pair of uh, Nike by U's. Awesome. I'm doing good, Brian. What's up? There you go, John. Oh yeah. Green. Yep. Blue, yeah, red. Oh. I got all four. Oh, nice, nice. All, all four of these aviators, and they all came with an eight slot, I think. Oh, cool. So I got it all four. Got, oh wow, number three of three hundred on the Elite Diamond Pro. Woo. Wow, that that's that's impressive. That is impressive. 16 and 1,000 on the burrito. Yeah. Yeah, that's some good numbers right there. Okay, little propel automatic. NH39. Which one are we talking about, Jay? You uh, talking about that, that pro? Uh, Jay Moore is asking. Um, if it's the open heart, it's not the NH movement. It was the uh, Miota that they went with on that pro diver. But yeah. it, if it, it had been, it would have been a 38. Uh, is 38 is the open heart. Uh, 35 is your standard three hand with a date window. And the 36 is three hand with a date window with 
uh, bilingual day of the week on uh, on the inside. Gold tone and black. Yeah. The propeller. They only did one propeller. Yeah. On each. Oh, okay. Yep. The the black really pops though with with that with that uh, bezel. Yep. Sure yeah. does. Very nice. Yeah, that's nice. And they got Invict on the side here. Yep, written. yep. Like reversed. Yep. Oh, that's cool, Vic. So his his uh the 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 him heard that he got for him and Janet the burrito hydroplated are fifty one and fifty two. That's awesome. Here's a bolt that they uh, showed last night. Actually, I got this about a couple of years. And, I was gonna say, uh, that, yeah, that one that one's been around a while. That's a good one too. This is a blue dial. I mean, it's hard to see, but it's blue. Yep. I know Trap was saying that's sweet. That's nice. Yep. Now is that um, the sub dial by the nine o'clock? Is that day of the week or is it? It's day of the week. Okay, so it's the uh, the the Z sixty. Yep. Okay. Beautiful bracelet. That knurling on it. Yeah, yeah, the knurling they did in between on that center link. Yeah, I like that. Beautiful. Now here's one that's. Hey Honda, welcome in. Welcome in. This bolt, I haven't seen it. Had the glass fiber. Yeah, the, the glass bezel. fiber in the blue, and then glass fiber on the dial. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, that one's nice. And then, and then they did the 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 crown and functions in the blue. I, I love when they do that because it 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 it's a little bit of a pop, but it really stands out when you. To me, when you do too much, then it it's not as distinctive. But when you do like just little subtle touches, I think makes it that much more unique. But really nice piece. Now, here's one I asked Ryan to bring back as well. This uh, sub aqua. <laughs> yeah. The carbon. Sub aqua. The carbon. Carbon, carbon fiber, case and cradle. Design, tr tire tread, <laughs> and your black mother of pearl. Yes. Yeah. Look, look at that. I, I actually have the uh, the Punisher in that in that version with the look. same colorations. Wow, it's super nice. I, I I love that carbon, yeah, and that the the die the strap on it is is amazing. It's amazing. It's like Absolutely a tire tread. I swear. <laughs> yeah, strong. Yeah, that's a good one. Yeah, Pappy's like Pappy's like you got a nice collection. Yeah, I totally agree, Pappy. He's, he's you've got you've got some good watches there, man. You got. Thank some, you very much. You know. Sure. It, it's hard to choose, and in the beginning, it's like you just want to get everything. Yeah. And then you start to learn, hey, let me wait, let me see, let me listen. And that's how you, you know, you pick up all the tricks, tips and tricks of the trade. You know, you just can't go and buy everything on, on you know, on the fly. Sometimes yeah. you got to wait. So... That's what I did, you know, what I do. And then I started getting sand threes, sand seven, sand one. Yeah. I don't have a two or a four, but okay. eventually I'll get one, you know. Yeah. Yeah. Twos, uh, here lately, uh, the fours have been around. I know Invicta Stores has had a few fours uh, laying about here recently. Um, twos, I haven't seen too many that haven't been diamond. Um, I know they're probably out there. Yeah, let me get to this case right here. <laughs> oh, gosh, watches everywhere. <laughs> yeah, traps over here saying all my venoms say 31 on them. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah. The uh, Russian diver ghost. Yep. Bridge. Yeah, or that's the, uh, is that the ocean voyage one? Um, No. I don't think it is. What's uh look at the uh the the angle right there at the seven eight. Is it got blue striping on it? Oh on the side, it's got some stripe, yeah. Okay. It's got yellow and black. 
Okay, the yellow and black. Okay, the the ocean was uh, blue and something. But yeah, I love that one with the little seahorse inside the crown. Yep. Yeah, those are super cool. She's still there. Yeah, yeah, I love that design. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, it's still yeah and that, that bridge, the bridge movement on it is uh, is unique. I, I love the way they styled it. And the guillotine uh, rotor, I love it. Yeah. Now, here you go. This is <laughs> the o Ocean Voyage. Got this before the cruise last year. Yes. This is number two. Wow. There you go. Number two. There you go. Yep. There's a little strap. God, Godfather's like, I always wait before buying a watch unless it's a pocket watch. <laughs> <laughs> he jumps right on that. He, oh. It's amazing. Yeah. He's got a great collection, Godfather. Yeah, let's yeah, those pocket watches are are, are amazing. And and even ones that are that are, you know, not even uh Invicta. Some of the, the vintage ones are just beautiful, the designs on it. Okay, which one's that? The Batman bolt. And bolt. Okay. There you go. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah. Not bad. Okay. And we got a sub aqua dragon. I don't know if you remember this one when it came out. Yes. Yes, okay. I remember that one. The blue silicone. Yeah, there was like a. It was like I think that one, but it did it in like three or four colors: blue, black, and I can't remember the other colors. Yep, really nice. The blue pops on this. Yeah, really, really nice. Yeah, I, I, I like the I like the way they did the, the bezel with the unique design around it. Yep. Yeah. It's got texture on it too. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's that's a good one. That's the thing. I mean, it's not it's not a huge in your face thing, but it's just some small details, and that's what I love about them. Is you know you don't have to. You have to do, you know, all kinds of craziness for a watch to have some unique designing in it. Oh, a Russian Diver Ghost. Yeah. Those. Okay. The Joker. Old, uh, Joker. Yep. There you go. Yeah. Grab that. The Sinister Smile. Yeah. Yeah, that's almost that uh, uh, Joaquin Phoenix style. Now, who has this bolt? Mm. It's got the gray. Uh, it's actually like mo abalone, mother of pearl, kind of. Okay. Okay. Beautiful. Nice. That's a yeah. That's a good one. I don't think yeah. I haven't seen too many of those. Nope. Yeah, that's a good one. Okay, that case is. Go to uh, another one. I got more in the back, North. No, no, no. You, you're, you got, you got to look at that one. That, that's a good one. <laughs> I don't care from people. <laughs> <laughs> uh, hey, I, I'm ready for the show. I told you. Yeah, man. You, 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 right. got, you got them popping all over the place. Aviator. Oh, okay, aviator. Yeah. Gun metal. Yep. Automatic, open heart, whatever you want to call it. Yeah, love it. Yeah, that that's a nice one. Aviator. Yeah, no, I really like that one just because of the gauge style they did with that is yeah. uh, is super cool. Yeah, beautiful watch. She's still running. Yeah. There's another one. <laughs> <laughs> Another radiator with the dials. You okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. I, I like the. Yeah, I don't think I've seen that one. Yeah, the the small the small little dials on it. That's pretty cool. Yep. And it looks like you know the gyro, uh, the attitude indicator. You yep. know, it looks like all that. What's the What's the model number on that one, buddy? Oh, I'll tell you. I'll pull it off here. Okay, model number two eight zero seven eight. 
Thanks, sir. 28078. Wow. Really look at it. Fixed bezel, obviously. But it's got this depth and dimension in it. It's like when it, it the rehot and everything it looks. Yeah, yeah. It, it, I mean that that one is definitely that's that's unique by far. That one is super. I, I love the details on that one. That is super cool. Uh, and the uh, the dial itself, it's got that look of the the dashboard. You know, yeah. the, the backdrop of it. Yeah. Really, really nice. Yeah, that that one is really cool. And then we have some more aviators. All right. We have gold, blue. Yep. Some of these. Oh yeah, with the yeah with the with that dial. I like the one that's got the the the, the uh, alternating yeah the colors on that one. A little bit of blue, a little bit of red. Yep. A bunch of gold. Yeah, that that that's nice. And then that that. The monochrome, what is that, all gold? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. In that cradle design. Yeah, I, I love that design. Yep, this case and cradle. In there. Beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> I'm convinced it's smack dab in the middle of the Invicta Warehouse vault. Not quite. <laughs> Not yet. Not yet, Trap. I'm getting there. I'm trying. I'm trying to be like Pete. I'll never catch Pete. Oh, okay. <laughs> Here's another one in black. Another okay. here. We 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 got we got a good one. This this one's this is a good good question. What's your rarest piece? My rarest piece. Or or what's the best story that you've got that that uh you know coordinates with a, a particular watch or something like the the story behind it. <laughs> Hold on a second. I got something beeping. Hold on. Sorry about that, John. Oh, no, you're good, man. Yeah, that was just... Uh, got to check who's coming in. Yeah, no worries. No worries. <laughs> All right. So uh, back to that question. My rarest peak was the best story to go with the watch. Uh, I'm trying to think. I don't know. My rarest piece. I got this. Uh, which one I got? I'm thinking. <laughs> uh, no worries. No worries. Yeah, I'm thinking. Al and RJ literally in the room handing Pappy watches. No, they're not. <laughs> Let me think about. <laughs> Let me think about that rare watch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We we we'll circle back around. Yeah, it's a little aviator. I think they uh -huh. showed this the other night, actually. Okay. Um, basic aviator. It's got the three sub dials, the date window, and it was actually on the other night. They brought it back. It was it was the threesome. Okay. The yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Here's another aviator. They came in, I think, three or four colors. I got my nephews each one, and I kept this one. And this nice. is the uh, black and silver. Yeah. With the compass dial going around it? That's yep. that, yeah. That's a good one. Yep. Okay, I got that case empty. So apparently you're going to need a shipping can uh, container for the next cruise if you're going to do the expo, buddy. Oh, geez. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let me get this down. Let me get this down. Okay. <laughs> Godfather's got a good one. There I was, fifty thousand feet, and this Victor just appeared out of thin air. 
There you go, 54 millimeter tinted crystal Grand Diver. Yeah. All black, blue. It's got a blue. Black, tint. blue. Yeah. Now, is and, that in the crystal, too? Yep. Yeah. It's a blue one. This one is blue. Yeah. Yeah, I was going to say, you could, you could, when you turned it away, you could really pick up some of the blue on it. You can really get some of the red with that one. Yeah. And this yeah. one's the first one they did. Okay. And then they came out a year later with these. Yeah. But an H35A. Yeah. That's a workhorse. Yeah. Absolutely. I know Trap got this the same time I did. Yeah. I remember that. All right. <laughs> yeah, right. Godfather's Godfather's uh Halo exploits. <laughs> Look at this. Oh, is, is that considered a black label? Uh, no, it's not. It's just okay. a smaller, it's like 45 millimeter. Okay. Um, pro that's diver. A pro diver right that's a pro diver reserve though, isn't it? Uh, this is not reserve. Really? Nope. It's not reserve. You want the model number? Yeah, no, no. I, it's just, I, or. Maybe I got the name wrong, but it's the one where it's got like the sides of the case are, are rounded and smooth, and it's, yeah. it's got that Sabaquanoma Six crown on it. Yeah, those are nice. Yep. I like that. Yeah, it's like a Valentine's watch, you know. Uh huh. Okay, here is the fade. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. When they came out with those ombres. Yep. Yeah, those are well, nice. I got her one as well. Okay. So how many how many does your wife have now? Um she's got about twenty. Okay. Sorry for the back and forth, but No no, you're good. Okay, perpetual calendars. Do you oh, remember see, when this I, came out? I I still do not have a perpetual. You got to get one. Yeah, I do. I, I need I need to get on that one of these days. You know, once you learn how to set it, it's really not that hard. But um, mine it jumped to March, so I guess I set it correct. I'm good. So I got two of them. Because yeah. you got to get the right leap year that gives you one to four. Yeah. So you you got to put like, like this year would be one. Right. And then 2024 obviously is a leap year. So it'll know to go to 29 and then jump back. Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. So yeah. Godfather is there. There was some grand divers out there in the non reserve edition that had the, uh, the smooth case like that. Okay. Good to know. Here okay. is the 47 millimeter Grand Diver, the nautical. The nautical with the flags. Yep, remember that, yeah. Ryan. Ryan yeah. launched that. Yeah, that 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 was that was really cool when they did that. Uh, and then you know, that that's some of the things that I, that I enjoy about that is, um, you know, when when they talk about like you know because Ryan's really big, um, you know, with all the you know nautical themes and everything, and talking about you know, the, the flag system and, and the numbering and lettering that they used to have to, uh, you know, message with and everything. That was super cool to hear that story. Okay, koi fish. Remember oh, this? with the tri-cable. Yep, with the tri-cable. Mm-hmm. And the silicone. Yep. A little engraving here. Yeah. So it's, it's red, silver, and blue. Yeah. Yeah, I, I will say of all the things, the crown they used on that can be a little aggressive on the back of your hand. <laughs> yeah, it is. It sort, sticks sort of out like, too sort much. like the Thunderbolt. Yeah. Yeah. But I, I, I love the design, all, all, you know, all told. All right, Brian. Night. Thanks for stopping by, buddy.
Okay, a little S1. Yeah. With that uh, leather That's cool nylon. because the, there's really not a lot of bezel to it, so you really get a lot of dial play on that. That's cool. Yeah. I, I, I like those designs. It, it, it mixes it up. I mean, I love a good, you know, stadium, re and all of that. And, you know, but sometimes when they do these these big open dials like that, you know, that that's really cool, too, from a design perspective. I like that. Really, really clear. Yep. Okay. It's another Grand Diver automatic. Just okay. in the uh, blue two-tone. Okay. So, Godfather was asking on that Koi uh, – is it an original with the engraved back on it, with the koi on the back? Uh, I I believe it is. Let's okay. look right now. I believe it is. Cool. This is the original koi with the engraving. Oh, yes. Let me see if I can get it correct to you. Right. Oh, cool. Almost. Right there. Oh, you had it. Yeah, that that's good right there. Yeah. Yeah, that's cool. Like I say, I mean, that's that's what I love about, you know, Invictus and some of the things is they put details. I mean, that's like even down to like um, some of the dual deployment class and everything. And they'll do like the machine swirling on the inside that you'll never see until you actually take one off. I, I, I love those designs. Beautiful. Rico, did you get the Pro Diver Magnum? Uh, no, I didn't. I think Vic has a Pro Diver Magnum. Um, I remember seeing it, and uh, it had the 1042, like on a 45 degree angle. Um, I didn't. I didn't jump on that one. Um, but yeah, it, it's uh, definitely different for sure. But no, I didn't jump on it. I force. Okay. A couple of years old at least. Yeah. Uh yeah. Beautiful. I love it. Yeah. Almost yeah. has like that uh a Biza look to it a little bit, but on the dial. Yes, yes. Yeah. Yep, it looks just like that. that yeah. Cool. Yeah, that's super cool. Here is a I think this is a sea hunter. Uh yeah, so that's the third. Well, if you, however you want to define it, it was the the smaller scale sized Sea Hunter in the fifty two. Yep. Yeah. So that's a nice nice piece. Yeah. Now, who got this watch? This I for. Uh, I don't think I got that one. I've seen it. And that I, I love the way they did the uh, the twisted braid on the inside, and the uh, the crown protector is fixed. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I mean, the detail here is unbelievable. You can see right through to the cable. It <laughs> almost looks like a gas jet. I mean. Yeah. Yeah. And Rick is saying that uh, the Times Square uh, called and they want you to bring them back by lunch. <laughs> <laughs> well, this was a this was a great deal on this. This was like 119, maybe. Wow. When it came out, and it, on a, on a reserve, that that's pretty good. Yeah. I mean, that's that that's well, spectacular. That's spectacular pricing on a reserve watch. And it's got the day of the week. The date, I mean, it's got the wheel, 30-second perpetual seconds. I mean, mm -hmm. it's, it's a great watch. It's heavy, yeah. very heavy. Yeah. So, Pappy's asking, do you have – oh, sorry, Godfather is. Do you have the uh, any of the Invicta Eyes, not the Eye Force, but just the Invicta Eye? I think that goes back a ways, if I, I'm not mistaken. The Invicta Eye. I think I have one. Okay. Okay, here's a couple of specialties. I picked them up because they were... Uh, to, right. You know, they came with eight slots, I think. Okay. And 
you know, I was on an eight slot roll in the beginning. <laughs> I was going to give these out as gifts, but I decided to keep them. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So, so, uh, I'm was asking about that, uh, crown, that fixed crown. I mean, the, the fixed crown guard, right. uh, he's asking if it, if it, you know, kind of digs. Um, not, not really. Doesn't yeah. really dig too much. Okay. And then here's one. All right. We all know what this is. Once you see it, you'll know. That is? Trans. Very good. The first, not the first, first one, but this is no. the one from like, uh, what was it, two years ago? Yeah, a couple years ago. Um yeah, it was the new style of the transatlantic. I actually had uh, somebody was showing me they had one of the originals, which was it was in like a um, almost like a tonneau shape, and the the whole dial would like submarine and then flip over on itself. Um, very very unique. I'm still interested. I'd love to. I mean, I've got one. I I got one of the uh, the bomber series. Oh, okay. uh, pinup girl, and uh, I I don't think the battery's died in it yet, but uh, I'm kind of uh, I'm I'm kind of curious to see how that um, how that sucker's going to come apart to do the batteries. <laughs> yep, yep. All right, let's see. All right, we got I four. Oh, so Vic's asking about the uh, your your. Um, have you considered uh, picking up any of the 50 or even the uh, the new 35 chest um, to store them, or do you do you prefer like the uh, the the sizing and everything of, of like the 15 and eights and everything? I thought about the 50 slots. Maybe one day I would get one, but now I'm on the 15 slot wagon. Yeah. And the eight slots, I've got too many. So right. I would definitely consider going a 50 slot. Couple now, have you of them. Seen that, you've seen that new one, right? That was it like 35 or something like that? That 65. That uh it's like a chest. The yeah. Truck. I saw that. That's that that's pretty nice. I mean, you definitely aren't gonna if I want to part with that bomber transatlantic, yeah, buddy. Uh <laughs> I'll, I'll message you but um i would not hold your breath on that one man that that one is kind of near and dear to me so yeah panther yep nice yeah that one's super nice yeah i like that a lot yeah that the colorways on those and and the uh, the the face with the the mask and everything, yeah, that one that that's one of the good ones for sure. Okay, is a nice bolt. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Now yeah, here, I've, now, uh, I've I've seen that before with. Uh, the, the big rectangular rifle cases that you could do it um, be a bit of a, a bit of work but yeah you could definitely get get quite a few in there with a with the right with the right system for sure now here's one that I haven't seen come back oh wow so uh, fats collection is saying that shop has the 50 slots now for 109 that's back down around the uh, the, the price that I bought mine at. Wow. That's a good price. Yeah, that that's a good, good price. Because here lately, they've been running like in the 130s and 50s. And I'm like, no, no, no. Yep. Here's one for you. Pro Diver Scuba. Yeah. Twisted Metal. Oh, yeah. Twisted Metal version. Yep. Yeah, that's a nice one. And the battery just went on it. So it's got to be three years maybe. Yeah. So, so Godfather, you've got you've got one of the bombers. There was two of them. Uh, do you have the one where she's leaning back? You know, because there's one where 
she's kind of sitting upright like this, and then there's another one where she's kind of leaning back. I think I've got the one where she's leaning back. I can't remember now. Hey, Texas T, welcome, welcome. We're just kind of going down the 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 pappy train here of watches. So, oh yeah, the uh, the twisted in the in the bolt. I love yep. that twisted cable design. The Swiss movement. This was the first one. Okay. Yep, the first which, one. Which uh, is that a what movement is that? Uh, Z60. Oh, okay. Okay. Yep. Yep. Great collection. Hi, John. Hi, T. And I got it in gold, too. Oh, right. Gold and black. Dark hair. Okay. Okay. Godfather, you got the dark hair. I honestly can't remember if mine's dark hair or not. These were great, great buys. I got another case over here. I'm getting it. Okay, you're gonna like these, John. Now what you got? All right. Just get just leaning some back. coffee here. Yeah, that's the one I have, Rico. The one where she's leaning back and the uh, the the plane is like in a in a fatigued green. Oh yeah. Is that Chewbacca. that's not the solo, is it? That's Chewbacca. Oh, that's the Chewbacca, okay. And here's here's Han Solo. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very cool. Very now, I, cool. I grabbed these after Chewbacca died in real life. I went and I bought both of these. Yeah. And then they were sold out and I got them. Yeah. Yeah, those those are those are going to be special for sure. Yep. Here is a green Hydromax. Oh, okay, the new school design. Yeah. Yeah. Got that carbon fiber going on. Yeah, yeah. You, you talking down. about the transatlantics, Vic, or, or the uh, the Tano's with um, Han and Chewie? Because yeah, I, I uh, the the Dakar, yeah. Dakar. Yeah, that that's cool. You seen that new one? I saw some renderings that has a similar look, except it's even more V-shaped. I haven't seen it. Uh, oh yeah, the Star Wars one. Okay, great. Um, I forget somebody posted it. Now I can't remember for the life of me. But oh, is it Kenny that posted it? Yeah, yeah, Kenny posted pictures. That one, that one looks really cool. He posted it with a bunch of the graffitis that were coming out. And a little basic bolt, you know, nothing yeah. too fancy. Yeah, yeah. No, but hey. That's no. Good. Something simple to wear. I do have a glycine. I will show it. <laughs> okay. Okay. Nice. Yep. Okay. Simple uh, NATO strap. I like it. Mm -hmm. Switch made, you know. GMT. Okay. Oh, was that okay? That would it looked familiar, but I couldn't I couldn't picture it. Thanks, Trap. Yeah. Beautiful watch. Yeah, those those are those are. I mean, it's just clean and classic. Oh yeah, cool cool strap on the back. Yep. Very cool. All right, let's see, see what else I got for you. All right. What else you got for me? <laughs> <laughs> Go around here. Let me open this one. Okay. Get that one. Get that one. Uh, I got another case. 
So, so what do you got all those cases sitting on, by the way, Pappy? Uh, a pool table, full size regulator. <laughs> so I, I, I take it you haven't you haven't pulled the uh, the, the pool stick out in, in a minute. Nah, I, <laughs> you know I'm gonna have to pretty soon. Yeah. <laughs> Oh case. yeah, there we go. Yep. Awesome. Now is that the one that you got the uh, the sub six in? Yes. Okay. Yep. That's the one. All right. Let me see what else. Uh, I did that. I did that. Oh. So we're 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 we are we we have got a request for uh, a story on on uh, on one of these or something. So. Oh, uh, there's got to be some. There's got to be a couple of these with a good backstory to them. <laughs> um, where did I put that other one? <laughs> uh, I showed that. I showed that. I showed that. I showed that. Oh, I got one for you. All right. I got it right here. You know, I got it right here. You got what you got. All right. It's going to be fun. Ah. Okay. Poseidon. Poseidon. Yep. Yeah. Love this. Yeah. Yeah, I love I love that design they came out with. I mean, like you say, the uh, crown pushes kind of like stick out, but yeah, yeah, they yeah with Triton, uh, yeah, they they do a little bit, but it's pretty heavy and. But I love the uh, I love the sub dials and everything. Yeah, it's a, it's a great yeah, one. The, yeah, the 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 nod to the. Uh, to the sand three with the with the three um big bolsters on the on the bezel yeah yeah mm -hmm. yeah it's a beautiful all black beautiful the shine to it yeah okay so godfather went and checked his he's got he's got the same one i have where she's leaning back yeah, blonde hair. Yeah, I I was running in the I was running in the closet real quick and looking, so I didn't I didn't catch the the color on the hair. But yeah, yeah, that's the one I have. Yeah, I couldn't get that one. I wasn't allowed. <laughs> <laughs> just it's wear just wear story. the other side. Just wear the other side. <laughs> it's a true story. <laughs> um, I showed you that. Showed you that. Showed you that. Oh, uh, anybody ever get a Popeye case? No, I, I don't think I've got a Popeye case. I don't I think got I've got too many cases. I've got I've got a Punisher case. Um, I got a couple. Yeah, you know, I got a couple of JT cases. I got I got this one that glows in the dark. This iridescent, or yeah, the the glow in the dark one. Uh, I got this this camo one up here. Um. I don't think I have too many. Do you got a Wonder Woman? Did you get a Wonder Woman? No. Oh yeah, she's got a, a white I Love Invicta. That's an eight slot. Um, get that one. Yeah, I don't have too many of the uh, of the uh, themed ones. I don't think. So. I showed you that. Oh. Yeah, the three slot Punisher. That's the one I have. Oh, I've got a three slot in the Batman. That's the one I was. Is that the compass? Yep. Yeah. And when yeah. this came out, <laughs> it, it it it's a it's a monster to wear, but it, it it is it is pretty cool. I will say that is is definitely uh, it, they they had to go at least that wide on that strap because that thing just is uh, a bit unwieldy. Anything smaller. Yep. But it is comfortable. Oh yeah, it is. It is. So Ellen's asking, do you got anything like fresh unopened? Uh not no. Nothing. I'm wait no. 
This was it the other that day, and I didn't the, open box. The Thanos. That was the most recent one you got? Yeah, and the uh, interchangeable Venom. Oh, okay. Yep, yep. With the gold mother pearl, all that. And, oh, wait, I have one more, John. Mm -hmm. What you I got? Have one, I have one more watch. All right. I think, yes. Let me close this compass up. Yeah, yeah. Hey, Imani. Welcome, welcome. And that's the bracelet to the uh, interchangeable Venom. Yeah. Yep, yep. Look how thick it is. Oh, yeah. Woo. Yeah, yeah. those Venom bracelets, they're, they're beefy. They are beefy for sure. Um, I showed you that. I showed you oh. before. Uh, so Vic's asking, what interested you in Invicta? Was it the build, look, quality, blah, 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 et cetera, et cetera? Like, what was your, what was, like, probably your, what kind of got you looking at that over other watches? Because I'm sure you've got other watches, you know. I mean, most of us do. Yeah. Um, I just like the build and the look, look of them. Yeah. And, and how they were made and the uh, polishing of the metal. I mean. Yeah, yeah. The, 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 the different fit and finishes and everything. Yeah. 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 The industrial finish, you know, yeah. all that. Polished. Yeah. So this is this is the one that, that Smitten was talking about. Oh, I got I got that one. Yeah. We got that one at the uh Invicta store when we were doing uh uh they they uh they had a, a small collector event and we went down there and that's what they gave us for uh coming down and uh Helping out and everything. Do I you remember you. the intrinsic with uh, the anti digitals? I've heard of them and I've seen some pictures, but I have not personally seen one. Um, yeah. Yeah, that I love Invicta and the, the camo. Yeah, the camo one, that one was really cool. I can't even remember what I got. What came in that one now? It wasn't the army. It was something. It was something unrelated, and I got that that camo. I honestly can't remember what I got it in now. Okay. But uh, I got one. Yeah, I've, I've heard there. Those are rare. Those intrinsics are uh, are really hard to find. Okay, I picked up. The Lupa. Grand okay, Lupa. Grand Lupa with the brown and the, the gold. Yep. So I know it's got the Japanese uh, movement in there, that small movement. Yeah. But uh, it's, it's pretty big. Yeah. It's yeah, I, I, got a, I got a couple of those. I got, um, I think it was silver red and silver green abalone. When they came out a year or so ago. Case back is nice. Yeah. Look, still got the protection on it. Yeah, I was going to say, you still got that and you got it on the case back too. I can see the red line. Oh, yeah. I still got it on. <laughs> <laughs> yep. I'm like Vic. He keeps it on. Yeah, he I does. He, he wears his watches with that on there. Yeah, he does. Yeah. I gotta he's, take he's, it off. He's all about he's all about keeping that wrist uh, pristine and clean. <laughs> Eventually, it'll wear off. One of these days. Yeah. So. <laughs> yeah, God, Godfather. He's like he saw the intrinsic when they came out, but it didn't smack him in the face. And and if it doesn't smack Godfather in the face, it's a uh, uh, see you around the next time. But. Uh, you know, it uh, to me, you know, and maybe, you know, it's, I'd have to see one again. Um, it, it's definitely probably one of those that, you know, if you get it, uh, it's one of those that, well, I, you know, I may not wear it alike, you know, a lot, but it would be nice to have, you know, from a collection standpoint. So, so I think I've got them all. There might be. A few in a box back yeah. there. But I think we might have went through most of them. 
Yeah, no, that's good. No, that that that. Hey, that that's a that's an impressive collection for sure. So yeah, the the question was, did anyone pick up that um that fifty mil um pro diver with the T one hundred uh tritium tubes? It was like three of them. Yeah, I want to get one. Yeah, but I, I I looked at it. A little pricey. Yeah, that I mean. Yeah, but, but yeah, I I definitely want one. But <laughs> traps in the NBZ. Yep, yeah, me too. Yeah, yeah, I, I hear you. I'm in the. Uh, I I won't say I won't say NBZ because you know I'll I'll pick up you know stuff. But I'm definitely in the. Uh, uh, I'm I'm in the Godfather stage. Like it's got to slap me around a little bit before I before I jump on it. So. Uh, I got you. Got you. You know. Yeah, absolutely, Vic. Uh, yeah, you got you got an amazing collection, buddy. That that you got some really nice ones. I mean, that's yeah. Thanks, Vic. That's amazing for sure. So, well, I know it's coming up on eleven o'clock, and you know it's a school wow. night for most of us, especially us uh, East Coasters. Um, so, if there's uh, if there's any, you know, like, you know, last questions or anything, um, you know, that anybody wants to, uh, to pose, uh, you know, shoot it in the chat. Um, what, what'd you, what'd you get? Oh, I'm in a slutty stage. I'll take any watch. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Sheldon. <laughs> Appreciate it. Yeah. But, and I, uh, yeah, you know, I, I want to say, you know, thanks for coming on and, uh, you know, sharing with us and, and uh, me and, and everyone out here in the audience that um, uh, amazing collection, you know, love some of the stories and, and things to go along with it and, and kind of, you know, hearing about, you know, how long you've been doing this and just, you know, just kind of getting to know you a little bit more and, you know, putting faces to, to names and voices on the TV and everything is, has been a lot of fun. And I'm, I really want to say thank you for everyone that's come on and, and will come on that, um, uh, really, uh, appreciate it because I'm, I'm enjoying this from a collector and everything as much as everyone else. So, you know, just a, a big thank you for, uh, for you know showing up and and uh, and all of that thank and, you uh, yeah uh all to all my mods especially uh my executive producer behind the scenes over here uh handling all, everything for me so but uh let's see we'll go through a couple more yeah i appreciate godfather staying up i know i uh so here, here's a parting question, you know, just to kind of throw out there and, you know, people can kind of, you know, leave me comments or whatever. Um, I'm considering moving this to like an 8 to 10 window uh, because it is on uh, Wednesdays and everything. I do have a collector coming up at the end of the month that actually requested uh, 8 to 10. So I think it just depends on where you're at and everything. But um you know, if everybody kind of wants to just maybe just weigh in, shoot me a DM or something like that, and, you know, just kind of give some thoughts on it or, you know, after this live is done, you know, maybe post a comment about um, everything, you know, from, you know, just to get, you know, everyone's kind of perspective because, you know, sometimes I, I think it's, uh, well, Sheldon, I know it's, <laughs> that's too early. Yeah. Well, it like I say, it, it depends. It's uh, if you're if you're West Coast, that's five. If you're East Coast, you know, it's a little different. But uh, I'll think about it. What I may do is I may just leave that open for uh, Aspen Peak info. Uh, sorry, um, I didn't quite get the question, uh, Heimdall. Aspen Peak, or I'm, I'm assuming probably um, that was an autocorrect, and I, it, it gets me every time. 
But anyway, um, you know, like I say, uh, you know, I want to say, you know, thank you to, to Pappy and everything for coming on and sharing his collection and, uh, and everybody for showing up and showing support and asking, you know, great questions and everything. But, uh, I, uh, I will be having another one, obviously, this coming Sunday. And if anyone, um, you know, can show up, I, I appreciate it. And uh, we'll keep this thing going. But for now, um, yeah, I appreciate Sheldon. Um, but for now, I say thank you uh, for being here. Thank you for my guest and everyone. And with that, I say enjoy your Invicta Time Pieces. And I'll see you next time on Watch Talk Live. Thanks, John. See you, everybody. Thanks for having me. Thanks, buddy. Take care, guys. Yep. See you, everybody.